WRO Investigates has been looking into officer-involved shootings in Raleigh. Cullen Browder joins us now with what he found. Cullen? Well, Gerald, as soon as we heard about this incident today, we started going through our records, our archives, as well as a database that tracks deadly police shootings. When it comes to RPD, you have to go back almost two years. The most recent shooting involving a Raleigh officer was back in May of 2020. Police say uh, David Atkinson had robbed a convenience store on Newbert Avenue. When officers arrived, they exchanged gunfire. Atkinson was shot and killed. An officer was also shot, but protected by a bulletproof vest. Now, we found that this was one of nine Raleigh officer-involved shootings that we have covered since 2016. Six of those nine were in fact deadly. Now, according to Mapping Police Violence, which tracks deadly interactions with police, and they use this metric, Raleigh police killed 1.5 people per million population. That's from 2013 to 2020. Uh, that's important because when you compare, that's essentially half the rate for Charlotte, Durham, and Winston-Salem Police, Greensboro's rate for their police department also higher than Raleigh. And Gerald, another important part of this, looking at our records, uh, in those nine shootings we found since 2016, all the officers involved were cleared. Colin Browder reporting live. Thank you, Colin.